Hello, this is Eva from Soul GPS. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm coming to you from England um, where I recently moved and also I realize it's been quite a bit of time since I checked in with all of you on YouTube. It's been close to two months and I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for all of your beautiful letters and checking in with me and asking about me. Uh, the short answer to the question, is everything okay, is yes, everything is okay. I'm doing fine. It's just been a very dynamic couple of months and I wanted to tie this video with a topic that could serve you also while giving you a bit of a general update about um, where I'm at in my own journey and my own self-healing and just share some snippets with you um, so that I can both satisfy your curiosity and at the same time to uh, provide you with some tools that you yourself could use if you happen to be going through something similar. So uh, first thing, um, I am, as I, as I just mentioned, just moved here to England where I'll be starting school shortly, uh, just in about three weeks. So this itself, uh, you know, took quite a bit of energy time planning. I also have been working quite extensively uh, throughout the year and I decided to just take about a month off for myself, a couple months off to just do some travel, spend some time with people uh, that I really love and that, that are close to me and also reconnect with nature, recenter myself and so on and so forth. And the third component of behind the reason why I haven't been active here on YouTube is that I have been actually dealing with some health challenges. Um, I do not believe that this is um, anything to be super concerned about, but it's also not something to ignore. It's actually impossible to ignore because I feel it pretty much all the time since December. So what it is, is that I have started to experience very intense headaches uh, starting in December. I still don't exactly know the full reason for it. I'm still in the middle of doing some testing, working with uh, a team of doctors, both natural doctors as well as conventional doctors. So I don't want to give you any misleading information, but I've, I've been able to gather quite a bit of very interesting data. Basically, um, one day a headache came on, it was in December, so it's almost been, it's been nine months. Um, and it never left. And I do not suffer from headaches. I never have. I never had migraines in my life. Um, it just, it's just something foreign to me. I, I, when people would tell me that they were suffering from headaches, I would always feel very compassionate towards them, but I could never quite relate to that because again, it's something that's, that's never, I've never had. So when this headache came on, it was, it was really intense. And I just thought, you know, a couple of days, it's probably going to go away. Maybe it's something I ate, maybe it's stress, uh, who knows, but it hadn't. I had a bit of a break um, in March and April where, where I felt much better, but then around June time, it amped up again and it just kept getting more and more intense and kept spreading throughout my body. So it affected my shoulder, first the right one, later also a little bit the left one. It affected my face. I felt um, kind of numbing, tingling in my face. It affected my a uh, little bit of my vision on the right side. And again, it, it spread down throughout my body. So occasionally I would feel almost like a little bit of like an electric shock in different parts of my body. So the, the one way I could summarize all of these symptoms is it was an, it's a nervous system inflammation. And it makes sense to me um, because looking at what I've been through uh, over the last three years where my life changed radically and I started doing this channel and talking about narcissistic abuse topic, I've processed a lot. And the way I like to look at this, and uh, you may not agree and that's okay, is that it is basically the old pain, the old wounds leaving my body. And actually this year, 2019, has been one of the best years of my life. Uh, I love what I do. I was able to um, apply and be accepted to an amazing school here in England to pursue uh, a passion of mine and continue to study. I've traveled to 
a dozen countries. I've met amazing people. And so I'm happier than ever. And so I ask myself the question, why am I experiencing this pain? So I almost feel if I were to uh, answer intuitively that it is the old tension leaving my body. But again, I'm still gathering data. Doctors, most conventional doctors don't know what's happening to me. Uh, so for nine months of going to, to their offices, all I've been told is you just need to relax, which has been, at first I took it in as, wow, maybe I am stressed, but the truth is I'm not. I live a very, very pleasant lifestyle. I don't have um, nervous spikes uh, like I used to. So th that's why I'm thinking it is likely something that's on its way out, or at least I hope so. Um, the person that's been the most instrumental in helping me was a naturopath, and she's been working with me, and ever since we joined uh, together, over the last month, things have been finally improving and pain has been releasing. And the other person that's been on my A-team is a, a shaman woman who has been also working with me on my soul level uh, where I am cleansing uh, old fears, uh, things that have been trailing me for some time, thought forms that are no longer serving me. So, so that's been actually having a great effect. And also, cleansing and upgrading my nutrition have been super uh, instrumental in helping me return back to something that's closer to normal but i'm also getting hints of that i will feel better than ever once i complete this journey so i'm strengthening my body i'm tonifying it i'm cleansing it with different herbs um, i am taking um, more uh, supplements for my nervous system I may share some of these things with you if there's something you're interested in, but I don't want to uh, pile this in in this particular video. Um, so basically my bottom line with this, with this is that I am fine. Uh, I'm feeling much better now. My energy in the last couple of months has been quite low, so I needed to conserve it and manage it. I've been coaching a lot, so I still work with clients full time, um, but just producing new content, I wanted to wait until my energy levels uh, rise up and to be ready to reconnect with you. And I feel like the time is now. So I have a ton of material I wanna share with you. I have a lot of new information that I will be putting out. So I just wanna to thank you for your patience and staying with me and uh, all of your support. So um, so what I wanted to convey to you, if if you are in this video, if, if you are in the process yourself when you may not be feeling, um, well, when um, you are maybe hitting up against some personal challenges, whether they are cognitive, uh, whether they are uh, physical, uh, maybe even spiritual, it's okay to take some time for yourself. In fact, it's an act of self-love. So I've taken the last couple of months to really reinvest in myself to to both uh, time-wise and money-wise to recenter so I can come back to you in a stronger, better way. And, um, and also it was an act of self-respect. I feel, um, you know, while part of me was saying, you know, you need to, you need to work, you need to do things, you need to put out more content. Uh, another part of me was like, no, it's okay. It's okay. We're not, uh, we're not operating in a linear universe. This is a, this is a multi layer universe. And by the fact that I am taking good care of myself now, I'm also sending a message to my viewers who, um, who can pick up, pick it up for me. Um, and, and to also set an example, right? Because isn't, isn't that what this is about? If I'm here to give you information, I better live it myself uh, to become credible. So this is why I, I did that. This is why I chose that. Again, I wanna thank you all so much for your concern and your care. Everything is great. Um, some things are better than ever. A life's been wonderful. Um, just uh, wanted to pick up the slack from some things that apparently um, needed some care, needed some, some, some care from me and, um, and I needed to also seek help from others, which is, which has also been a lesson because I've been a Miss Independent for, for far too long and it was quite humbling to realize that 
there's some things that I can't do on my own. I need help. I need it, um, other people in my life to be there for me. So, so for all of you who've been there for me, and if you're watching this video, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I love you. I thank you so much for this time and for everyone else, for all of you. Respect yourself. Take care of yourself. Put yourself first. It's very important. And um, yes, and um, be you. Be authentic. It's okay to do that. Okay. Thank you so much. Much love to you and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.